Yeah, it's something about big balls and... Hey, would you look at that? It's the motherfucking boy basement. Chef Silly B in the house. We in outer space right now. I'm with Chef Silly P. And Hello. we're about to make spaghetti and meatballs because this is what, you know, Chef Silly P was asking. You know, he was like, yo, I like pasta. Make a motherfucking spaghetti and the meatball. Meatball, you know what I'm saying? So that's what we're going to get right to it, all right? First step, my guy. You need to get good quality meat. Mm -hmm. Here at, you know, Chef Silly B's house, we do it the fucking best. So in this case, I like to get a, a pound of ground beef normal. And then, you know, some uh, diet lean. For my balls of meat, you know what I'm saying? So Chef Silly P, all right? He's a, he's a newcomer to the cooking game. How, how long have you been cooking, Chef Silly P? Cooking? <laughs> I heard your legendary recipe is uh, dino nuggets. Dino nuggets and mac and cheese. Uh, Are those your favorite foods? Don't or? catch me near an air fryer, because I, I go crazy. I go crazy. But um, I've been cooking probably for about three months right now, and it's, it's going pretty good. It's going pretty good, I think. So uh, why the name Chef Silly P, you know, like, uh, you know, I pee and I'm silly. <laughs> <laughs> uh, use about, for every pound of meat, use a cup of, of breadcrumbs. That's the general rule of thumb. I actually like to go a little bit less, so. <laughs> all right, silly. Okay. Make sure it gets all in the meat. Flip it. I'll let you pour in the second cup, Mr. Really? Silly P. Good. I'm gonna do a full cup as well, you know? Perfect, I'm perfect. Great. I'm feeling great on this Sunday. Mmm. You know what I'm saying? A little, mm. little wow. You know why you do the breadcrumbs? <laughs> Should I go the full thing? Of course. Oh, wow. Hey, listen. Messes are part of the experience. Don't worry about it. Okay. <sighs> Hold up. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Two eggs. For every cup of breadcrumbs, you're gonna throw in the eggs. Bow, bow, bow! Boom. Boom. <laughs> we got a shell in there. Oh, God. Oh! Oh, yeah. Next yeah. thing's next. For this recipe, we need some fresh parsley for our balls. Nothing like a little bit of veggie for the ball. Who busts out an actual spoon when they, you know, measure a tablespoon? No one, bro. <laughs> what are you, what are you? So, uh, that's like one. It's about one or something. Another one. That's like two. Boom, boom, on the mat. I call this the mat. I love UFC. Start getting it diced up nice and chopped. Chopped. Oh. So it's fucking chopped. It's ready to go. We throw it in the meat. Boom. Ah. You know, usually when I crush up some green green, it's for something else, bro. I'm getting faded and oh, faded and oh, faded and oh. But hey, Chef Silly P, I want you to take it from here. Get into this meat like you have a beef, like a beef with the beef. And I want you to just start mm, 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 working ah. it like a massage, working it like a, like ah. you love it. Oh, a massage, okay, okay. Yeah, you know so rough but tough, you know, pain equals gain. Okay, yeah. Should I spread it, spread, spread it around, around. all the ingredients. Oh my goodness. And don't worry about the mess, my guy. Don't worry, because the mess the equals the best in the kitchen. Ah, ah, ah. Fun fact for those watching, this man right here is actually the, the the one who actually invented the logo that you love so dearly. Silly, silly. Oh man, not to you know. You ready to make some meatballs? What we're gonna do now is we are going to grab a bowl. Okay. Sh And let's start making balls. So here's how you make a ball, right? We're gonna team, we're gonna tag team this shit. You take about a ping pong, yeah. roll it, give it a smack, give it a smack. All right, all right. Look at that, yo! Look at that fucking ball. Throw it in the bowl. Next one, and we just keep doing that. I'm that this, I made this one a little too big. Can we just take a moment to appreciate this gigantoid? Yeah. Mm. Re roll, re roll. A little bit more off the top. Ooh, perfect. Relax, bro. You're not gonna freaking burn down the house, I will bro. Burn your house down. I Fuck it, then. We burning the house down. We lit as hell in this bitch. I got a fucking cake. Okay. I got a fucking cake. Trust me, bro. I just ripped my fucking antennas off, bro. 
All you need to do, man, you get the pan hot, you throw a little extra virgin olive oil and spray for them. Any brand, don't fucking matter. And then you fucking put it in the pan and you throw the goddamn balls in there. You know, you can do about six or seven at a time. Get them nice and hot. You hear that sizzle? Medium heat. We grab the shit. That's four plus four. This thing gets the balls turning, this thing gets the balls grabbing. My fucking, my fucking cake. What the hell are you doing? I, I wasn't very good at math. Chef's lady wasn't good at math. What I was good at is showing up, making these balls taste crisp and delicious. It's been a minute, we spin the globe. And they're gonna stick. You know why they're gonna stick? Cause it's probably actually been longer than a minute and I'm being a bad boy. <laughs> So you said to spin it a little bit, like a just a, towards the pink. All right. <clears throat> it's pretty good, buttered, you know. Oh yeah, these babies look just so fun. All right. Perfect. Perfect. I'm a little nervous. Hold now. up! Hold up! Oh shit! Calm down. All right, all right. Remember, the odds are not against you. Anybody can make this. Oh my fuck. Oh my god, you did it, bro. We're gonna let these balls cook and we'll be back. Oh my god, I'm about to cry. It's stage two, people. Welcome back to the Chef Silly B Show. It's time to get the sauce, you know? If you don't got your own sauce, then you ain't really about shit. So, Salt. I need you on chopping duty. Oh, man. For this, we got fresh garlic. I need you to do eight of them. Just chop them up, dice Whoa. them up. One, two, three, uh, four, five, six, there you go. Do that. And then bam, 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 bam. bam. Do that shit, bro. You got this. While you're doing that, I'm a troll. Okay. I got fucking Dracula's worst nightmare besides this garlic. A white onion. Yo. Mm -hmm. Onions are so crazy, bro. You like onions? You know, I like them cooked. You know? They be good. I, I don't like them all. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh! Hold up. That's all I got, really. Hold up. Oh! And with that, we're ready to start getting the shit in there. This is the best part. <laughs> Boom. Oh, Pop the chi cheese. Why not? You know, why are green chili is better than red chili because I don't know green is health green is mm, look at that from here on out we give it about 40 minutes of just oh my goodness of just getting to be perfect and we just kind of break up the tomatoes and about 40 minutes in guys you just add the balls give it another 10 minutes add the pasta and you're good oh my oh motherfucking god bro I'm getting so hungry are you hungry, Silly Pete? It doesn't just smell that. It smells it immaculate. Smells but what pot of spaghetti and meatballs is good without no stick bread? So go to your local bakery as well. Come on, get this is for all the fixings. A real Italian restaurant, perfect little. Hello. Boom, boom. What good bread table is without some butter? Yo, we got butter in here, bro? Come on, where where that? Which one? Oh. Oh, there it is. Ah. It's been about 30 minutes, almost close to 40. Once we get to 40, we throw the balls in the sauce. We got the pasta cooking. And boom. We'll see you when it's all together. Ah, silly. I got these motherfucking balls, and I'm about to put them in the sauce. Yeah. Ooh, perfect. Maybe a little too much balls, but oh my god, the moment we've all been waiting for. Chef Silly P, are you ready? Man, I'm so ready. Oh my god. One spoonful of spaghetti. Yeah. Perfect. Oh, oh, oh. We need our sauce. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Boom. 
I say two balls is probably the best serving, but look at that. Perfect drizzle of the tomato. Perfect. Dang. Now we move to the cheese. Ah, oh, get out of here. Some safety shit. Hey, this ain't for you, doggy. Oh my god. That's it. Let me know how my recipe is. You take the first dibs, man. Alright, man. It's that time. It looks freaking spectacular. A pasta. Oh my god. And meatballs. I'm gonna I'm a wrap the noodle right as shown. Okay. With boom. the meat. Oh. Boom. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Then I'm gonna the get some savory. meat in it, right? Boom. You but see on, that beautiful part? On the side, I'm gonna have the bread ready at go. <laughs> so, hold on. This is the magic, bro. Mm hmm. Oh my god. This is why we do it, people. I hope that's good. I knew it. I, I knew it. How it tastes? Zesty enough? That's the most zesty, exquisite, beautiful, fantastic, marvelous, extraordinary, excited, marvelous, marvel, Captain Marvel dish I've ever had in my life. And that's why we do it, people. This has been Chef Silly B with Chef Silly P, also known mm -hmm. as Poozy. Hit him up. Yeah. Make my spaghetti. Let me know if you like it. If not, we still human. And we got more recipes coming that you may like. Yeah.